unlocking the secrets of the meat patty. Ag research scientists have made the first and most difficult step in tracing individual patties back to the farm where they originated from. Up until now, tracing meat has been limited to single cuts like steak. The reason we're looking at tracing patties is that most of our trading partners have now got legislation in that they, they require traceability. Um, they, some of them require traceability back to the farm, some of them require traceability back to a country of origin. But as time goes on, they're going to want to go further and further. By using DNA, the scientists have been able to trace the source of the meat right back to the farm. The technique is even more incredible considering the average meat patty is made up of over 40 different animals. If you want to trace a steak, it's quite easy. You get your steak on your plate and it can only come from one animal. You want to trace a meat patty because it's made up of the, the bits that are trimmed off normal meat. They all get mixed up together and there's lots of individuals in every patty. The world first technique uses existing technology as well as new ways of analysing DNA. All of the tests that we've done so far, we pulled them all together. We had 16 patties that we'd looked at. They could have come from up to 40 different batches that had been manufactured over a period of seven months. And we got every single one of them right. We got all, all to their correct batches. Now, if we were going to go through and pick a patty up and say, I think it came from that batch or I think it came from that batch, in other words, guess at it, the probability of getting all 16 of them right is 9.2 times 10 to the minus 27, which is, you wouldn't do it. <laughs> Well, so far the technique only expands to batches of patties. Ag research are confident that tracking an individual meat patty back to a single animal is achievable within two years. Jeff Yorston, 9 Local News.